Hi everyone. So another one more opportunity for BSc Chemistry aspirants. Indian Oil Recruitment 2023. Through this Indian Oil Recruitment 2023, uh, you have one more opportunity. So I'm going to provide you detailed advertisement notification, and I'm going to discuss important points regarding this. Uh, just check once if you feel that you are eligible for this post. Please apply. Okay. So first of all. You have to type this iocr.com slash latest job opening in your Google search. So after you type this, this uh, site, this page will open. So if you just go down here, detailed adverti advertisement notification is there. Right? Detailed, detailed advertisement is there. You have to click here. So after once you click here, this thing will open. Right? This page will open. This page will open. And if you see, I'm going to discuss discuss important points only. Here, the starting date is 1st May 2023, and the last date is 30th May 2023. Right? So, if you see here, this is a uh, number of posts and, uh, and reservations. So, the first post, Junior Engineering Assistant for Production. Okay. So, the refinery is Gujarat Refinery and Halida Refinery. Both are there and next post junior engineering assistant for P and U and last post is not for us, not for chemistry aspirants, right? And here total 47 total posts are there, 20 unreserved, 4 EWS, 3 SC, 7 ST and 13 OBC, right? And here for this post, total 7 posts are there, 3 for unreserved, 1 EWS, 0 SC. 1 ST and 2 OBC. Okay. And if you see important things, here positions are operated with work arrangements in 1, 2 or 3 shifts. So these are not important. Women candidates are not eligible for above posts as they are not considered for vacancies in production P and U operations. So women candidates are not eligible for these posts. If you are male candidate, you can apply. Next one. Post-wise qualification parameters here, junior engineering assistant for production and here three years diploma in chemical engineering. Uh, so here if you see, yes, BSc maths, physics, chemistry or industrial chemistry. So if you are the candidate who is with the maths, physics, chemistry background and if you have the eligibility of BSc, then you can apply for this post or if you have the industrial chemistry uh, background, then also you can apply for this post. Okay, and also with the minimum of 50% marks in aggregate for general EWS OBC candidate and 45% for SCST candidates. So minimum you have to have a 50% marks in your BSc, right? So next post is Junior Engineering Assistant 4 and here also if you see BSc Maths, Physics, Chemistry or Industrial Chemistry from the recognized institute or university, right? Uh, along with boiler competency certificate with second class or national apprentice, uh, apprenticeship certificate in boiler attendant under the apprentice, apprentice right so you have to have this uh, eligibility along with bsc for this post but for this post if you have bsc then you are eligible for junior engineering assistant 4 so this post is not for us next one important notes related to qualification here <coughs> for BSc, sub, uh, BSc subjects as specified against respect to posts above will only be considered as the eligible qualification uh, diploma or BSc or ITI in other specified branch or subject shall not be considered okay so qualification prescribed prescribed above shall only be considered no claim okay these are not important just go down like this now post wise experience and for this post, right? So for this post, you already know BSc is the eligibility and also work experience. Minimum one year of post qualification work experience in operations of pump house, fired heater, compressor, distillation column, reactor, heat exchanger, etc. in a petroleum refinery 
or petrochemicals or fertilizers or chemical or gas processing industry so if you have any uh, of this uh, experience work experience then you, you are eligible for this post okay so remaining things you can read by yourself and here other important things just wait yeah minimum and maximum age limit minimum eight minimum 18 years and maximum age limit shall be 26 years for unreserved candidate as on 30th 4 2023 right april 30th by the april 30 2023 you have to have 26 years maximum age limit and certificate issued by board of secondary education for passing matriculation or higher secondary shall be only acceptable document in support of proof of age right so these are not important next one next one is date of rockning eligibility criteria the date for the purpose of process, uh, process, possession of prescribed qualification and work experience at meeting age criteria shall be 34 2023 selection methodology the selection methodology will comprise written test and a skill or proficiency test or physical test the SPPT that is nothing but your physical test or skill test or proficiency test will be of qualifying in nature so just this test is in qualifying in nature question paper in any discipline to have the following three sections okay so for any post these sections will be there subject knowledge 75 marks for suppose if you are with the bsc uh, maths physics chemistry and regarding the regarding your subject 75 marks and numerical ability 15 marks general awareness 10 marks okay this is the exam pattern and every candidate will have to secure a minimum of 50 percent marks minimum of 15 50 40 percent marks in the written test for being shortlisted for qualifying for this exam right so you have to get at least 40 percent marks next next pay and perks uh, besides basic pay and industrial pattern of da all other advances benefits including hra you can read this okay so next one pre-employment medical fitness you can read this uh, a candidate is allowed to apply for any one post in case of receipt of more than one application for more than one post all applications will be rejected okay you can apply only one post among these three actually uh, we have two uh, jobs here we have two posts here for our bsc candidates so you can apply for one post only next how to apply so you can read this total entire application process is very very easy you can go through this uh, notification to apply online right so next important thing date of opening of online application 1 5 2023 and last date of online application 35 2023 right may 30th and date of receipt of printout of online application form along with uh, supporting documents by ordinary post 10 6 2023 tentative date of written test so written test will be conducted on 11th 6th 2023 that means june 11th right and likely date of publication of written test result shortlisted for uh, for the interview that is 27 6 2023 okay so this is the notification so if you want to apply you can apply for this post thank you so much for watching